Hello again everyone, this is Momizi Xran, and today this will be a bonus episode of Toho Chemblum. This is gonna be a conclusion of stuff that I missed and trying to reconfirm some rumors or some secrets. And right now, I'll first go off to chapter 14, Gaiden. So hold on a second and we'll go together. We're at chapter 14 Gaiden and today we're gonna find the secret shot that I missed in the stage. I didn't know there was one before. So let's go take a look where it is. It's around this area here, but since it's filled with enemies, I'm not gonna bother clearing it out. I'll just show you where the shop is instead. And here's the shop. From the top left, one, two, three, four. Secret shop is right here. And what do we have in the shop is, um, this mysterious bow. I don't know if it's, I don't know if it's a, no, it's not a sniper weapon. Okay, it's a normal bow, but I don't know who's it for, to be honest. I can't, I don't even know. Uh. For Nitori is the lightning bow, the fire gun, and there's a weapon for Komachi in the stage. So, I might as well buy this one and then give it to her and show you what it sounds like. If there's a theme for her, I hope. But anyway, let's go back down here. And Chen, be good. Thank you. And Chen, take out the spear. The... I think it's called the Shiniga Shinigami Spear, yes. So that should be it for that. Trade. Trade said spear. Here you go. Can't believe I actually missed this secret shop in this stage, that's for sure. So after this, let's go- Ah, oh, dang it, I'm not even close enough. Alright, fine. I guess I'll take some hits. Uh, ah, crap. Okay, made a wrong move. I changed the weapon by accident. <laughs> Someone's gonna die. Oh, great. Oh, wow, 22. Oh wow, four. Well, I guess I show off Yugi Sprite attack animation. I didn't show for once. Quite weird. Really weird. Uh, yeah. That's gonna suck. Okay, Yuko will survive. Pretty odd. I didn't think that will happen, to be honest. Oh well, whatever. Ugh. Um. Okay, that was another miss. Yeah, whatever. That was quite surprising. And I wasted a few minutes trying to get an attack off. Quite stupid of me. I can't believe it. There we go. Let's see if the music changed or not. Holy crap! 
Well, that's, uh, that's her theme, and I should have gotten this weapon for her then if that was the case. Damn, this weapon is so hot. Even though, well, I'm not sure. Is the attack bar too low, though? Let's take a look. Well, give or take, the attack power may be low, but the percent rate of critical is so high. Dang, I wish I got this earlier. That's for sure. But anyhow, we're done with 14 guiding now for the secret shops and Komachi's theme. So, I'll see you at another stage. So, hold on. So, we're back at chapter 17. And today, I'm actually gonna get Alice to die. Because we're trying to get the character Shinky. Uh for several reasons, and I don't want to kill Alice, but I have to, in order to get her. We actually had to kill her in this chapter or before the previous chapters, but the conditions are is that you have to uh, rescue Alice first, or rather recruit her, and when you do recruit her, then she has to die, and she will probably join at most. However, there's a issue right there is that you cannot, I repeat, cannot kill Alice as an enemy first. You have to have her as an ally, otherwise the whole sequence will be quite off. So yeah, first I'll show off Alice getting, at the, do an attack animation and then die. And then I'll skip to the chapter getting cheeky then. That's how I'll show it. and Chen finish the stage. Now, let's play through the sequence all over again, watching this dialogue. Notice the dialogue changed when that Chen mentioned that Alice died. So yeah, and right now Shinky did mention Alice, and the part this is probably the part where she will join the army. But you're also locked out of a good ending, or rather the best ending for killing Alice, which is kind of sucky. And also here's the message: Shinky joined as an ally as well. Or friend, whatever you want to say it. Alright everyone, now we're in chapter 18, I might as well show off um, Shinky, or rather Alice's mother. Uh, pretty sure it's Alice's mother anyway, because technically she is from the PC 98, er 98 era, and she did first appear there with Alice, when Alice was a child. I'll give her a book to attack to show off her attack animation, and also I will also put out Tenshi and Aideen as well. Because technically we never heard their theme, have we? So let's do that. And let's see who to ditch. Yeah, I ditch you, I ditch you. I need a tank, of course. And. It's... where the heck did I put them? Uh, okay, there we go. Can she... Um... Where did 18 go, to be honest? Okay, there we go. 18, and also Remilia Scarlet. Because technically, I do have their weapons, and I might as well put their themes on when I'm at it. Don't worry, I'll cut to the animations anyway. So, just hold on a second and let me get the enemy together. 
Okay, now I can cut to the attack animations for Tenshin, Aiden, uh, Shinki, and also Remelia. Uh, just to show their attack animation, also the theme music if they have one. So first, I'll send off is... Uh, Aiden. Okay, I guess Tenshi doesn't have one. Eh, it was worth it. So, only Aiden has it. Pretty odd. Tenshi doesn't have it, even though that's her weapon? Pretty strange. Really odd. Now for Remelia. Uh, that sprite animation for Shinki is good. That's for sure. I like that. All right, so I showed them all off now, and the last thing to do in this stage is find the secret shop. So if I find it, I'll let you guys know. So hold on. Sorry about that, guys. I can't find the secret shop in chapter 18. I know there is one, but the instructions are confusing as hell. I couldn't even find it, judging from the machine translation that I found so sorry about that guys so I had to skip chapter 18 secret shop but I'll check out chapter 20 uh, see if the rumor is correct saying that Marisa visits the town she gets master spark if that's true then hooray if not then we're screwed so let's take a look if it's true or not Nope. Okay, so it's false. So that one is false. Okay. Now just let Marisa die and then we just continue on with the story. Okay, Marisa died, so that's good. Now. Here's what happens if Marisa dies in chapter 20. As you recall, when I played, I saw Mima, but she didn't join us. She didn't give us anything, which is quite strange. So this time, what will happen if Marisa dies? And here you see Mima joins as an ally or a friend. Now we have her on our team. Also, she comes with two spells, the ones we the one we bought or stole, and she has Master Spark. Awesome, right? Her rank is all A, so yeah. But let's show off Master Spark to be honest. Nope. <laughs> Even though that miss, it's still funny. Anyhow, that explains chapter 20. So, I think that should be all, unless I'm missing Utsuho. Yeah, I could be missing. Uh, yeah, you know what? Maybe I should go back and get Utsuho instead. So, hold on till that chapter. Okay, I'm back at chapter 22, and I just got back Oku. Now let's see if she has a special animation, to be honest. Let's take a look. He used Giga Mega Flare Stone. Wow, that's a huge difference. Look, the normal Fire Dragon Stone is 11. Mega Flare Stone is 38. So must be, maybe. Let's take a look. Wow, it is. <laughs> Holy crap, so it is. Alright. 
So I guess that should be all then. Yeah, that should be all. I Once again, I do apologize for not being able to find Chapter 18 Secret Shop. So forgive me for that. If one day I do revisit this and I do manage to find it, I will show you, to be honest. I'll promise that. That I will promise. So I hope you enjoyed this bonus episode of Toho Chemblum. And until the next time we see each other again, we don't know when. Until then.